Arabian news, and we are standing, believe it or not, right now in the middle of the Arabian desert. And in fact, we are on the Dubai shopping mall, and right behind me here is the Burj Khalifa. And to our right here in the water, in approximately 30 seconds to 60 seconds, you're going to see the dancing fountains. This is the world of the dancing fountain that everybody talks about. This is the most incredible city in the world, and I urge you to log on to our website, www.uaeopportunities.com, and you'll be able to see a list of services that we provide to let people come out and experience this for themselves. We try and make everything simplified and keep it as easy as we possibly can to help you to achieve your dream of getting over here. So we're going to cut for now, and when the fountains comes on, we're going back to give you a look at that. Here we are coming back as you will see. This is the start of the dancing fight. Oh my god! view of the Burj Khalifa. As you can see it changes colours. This is just absolutely amazing and we're having having dinner here in the restaurant and the prince and his dad has just left after eating in the same restaurant. Very very friendly, lovely person. Uh, hope to get a meeting in his office with him tomorrow. Uh, but just to give you a view of the Burj Khalifa. This is the most celebrated building in the world. It had the biggest fireworks display. It was opened in 2009 and it is owned by the uh, Prince here of Dubai uh, family. This particular area we're talking about here, I'll just swing the camera around here. You can see it. Extremely, extremely wealthy. And we just come off a open top bus and we've heard the history behind how Dubai was actually built. This is back to the Burj Khalifa again. But, uh, 
we are, as I said, we're standing in the middle of the Arabian Desert. Um, this is where this is actually being built on. And in actual fact, the way Dubai was built was that they gave land to the very well-off around the world to entice them to come here and to spend their money and to build. And that's why. And they reckon they've only won 10% of what they hope to achieve here in Dubai. What a fantastic opportunity for developers, for builders, anybody wanting to seek a new life, now is the time. And we also have Expo 2020 coming up, uh, which is you'll hear more about. Just again, if you log on to our website, we'll keep you updated. Um, it's www.uaeopportunities.com.